Come on, Chris. You want to lose another sale? Aren't you back more? Uh, I got it. Ah! Ah! <laughs> That's good. We got it. South Park, one of the most funny and iconic, hilarious animated shows on the planet. That's why today we're reacting to all the real estate scenes and shenanigans from this iconic show. But before we get into it, I'm real estate expert Mark Magston, and I created this channel to help you with all your real estate needs. If you want to sell your home, please subscribe to my channel and get in touch with me today. Let's take a look at this wild, satirical show. Mrs. Cartman, being a real estate agent takes a lot of intellect and a lot of raw talent. If you look in the corner of this, $299,000, maybe 30 years ago here in San Diego for a condo. Haven't seen those prices for a while. You have to get your picture taken. Get people to like the picture and go, oh, I'd like to hang out with that person. It's so classic in our industry. A lot of times you have to have the headshot. Look at him in the corner. He's got cardigans posing. Come on, Chris. You got to look really welcoming. I'm trying. Come on, arch your back more. I'm Arch as far as I can. If you look at this gentleman's choice of colors, he's got a yellow shirt, a red tie, power tie, I'll give him that, and then a green suit. I don't know, I go more clean, simple, dark blue, crisp. I don't know about this one though, we'll see. <laughs> Come on, Chris, you wanna lose another sale? Arch your back more. Uh, I got it. Ah! Ah! <laughs> That's good, we got it. We do a lot of this stuff for real estate sales. I've never cracked my back quite like that, but we'll see how this goes. Excuse me, there's all these city people moving into town and I think I'd like to sell my property. Oh, we really? Good. That's great. Right. Hey, hey, yeah, we're we're like house. House. And a lot of times where our office is located here in La Jolla, we do have people that walk by they will physically knock and come into the, the office. We can potentially get a listing. I did have a girl about a year ago open up the door and say, hey, I'm looking to buy a property. I showed her two homes and sold her a million dollar property in PB. So that was actually pretty cool. Does it happen often? Not as much. Most of our stuff is online, internet leads, stuff like that. It's definitely a seller's market right now. It's good you came to South Park Realtors. All right, so he says it's a seller's market. There's really a true lack of inventory right now. For example, we listed a property two days ago in a, in a town called Rancho Panasquitos. It has 15 offers and it's going for $275,000 over asking. It's a simple, basic house that you could use some updating, but yes, it's definitely a seller's market because there's no inventory. Over at South Park Realty, man, they are hitting it on the head. Have you ever heard of a real estate agent, Butters? Well, not really. Yeah, well, neither had I. So I looked it up on a bunch of those shows and stuff. You don't do anything. You just look nice and hug people, and then when someone buys or sells a house, you make money. If that was the case, I would be crushing it because I like to look nice, I like to dress the part, and I, I love hugging people, maybe even like a high five now and then, but we do a little bit more than that. <laughs> wow, well that sounds like a good deal. It's more than a good deal, Butters. It's legal theft. If my mom can be a real estate agent, then literally anyone in the world can. Everyone assumes that real estate agents just make a bunch of money, we drive around in fancy cars. It's a 24 seven, seven days a week, always answering the phone, always checking text messages, emails, and stuff like that, so this is great. I know you assume it is, but it's not. Once in a lifetime, a property comes up for sale that is so unique, it defies words. Something so unique, a house that defies words, he's telling us right now that he has nothing to say about the home. It's hilarious how like we use different words and different sayings to make a house seem like it's bigger or better or cleaner or neater than it is. This is the historic Aspen Park hot dog. 200 square feet of pure luxury. 200 square feet of pure luxury. When I think of pure luxury, I think of something in the south of France. That's 20 by 20. That's a normal size bedroom in San Diego terms. <laughs> and that's this dude's entire house that he's selling? Crazy. You want to move out of the city and enjoy the laid back country life? It's all here. This actually looks exactly like the Oscar Mayer Wiener Mobile. It just needs tires. The laid back country life in a hot dog house. South Park Realty, come on. Hey guys, it's Eric from South Park Realty Group. Are you dreaming of moving out of the city and into the beautiful country, Dad? I love how, you know, they kind of cruised in. They did a little drone footage. But Cartman, man, he was talking way too fast. Tone is key. You don't want to get it all in. 
You want to take your time and relax a little bit. I want you to check out Clyde's house. This is a 2,300 square foot mid-colonial home, detached garage, now listing for just $3.5 million. Let's check it out. $3.5 million in South Park? I, I just don't see that selling for three five. dollars Maybe easy here in San Diego County right now, but I don't know about in South Park. This house is so spacious. I think my cameraman Butters can attest to this. Is this nice, Butters? Yes, will, will me. I mean, now look at this guy. He's all G'd out. It actually looks like a satin set of pajamas to me, but he's got the fancy gold watch on. So, I mean, he hair is combed. He's dressed on the park. He's ready to sell this house for $3.5 million. Double doors lead to the unfinished backyard. Plenty of room here for a pool or a horse stable. This is just one of the amazing properties we have at South Park Realty Group. We've got other great listings like Craig's house, Wendy's house, and my personal favorite, Kyle's house. Get out of that sewage drain you call a city and start living the country life you've always wanted. South Park Realty Group. Get out of the city and into beautiful South Park. I mean, Carmen is actually a good little salesman. He's painting the picture of the pool and the backyard. He's got the lawn chair laid out. He's drinking a cocktail. So, I mean, it's inviting people. It's having people think about what can be. This is good. Absolutely love South Park and I love South Park Realty, but I am not taking any tips of the trade from this show. <laughs> Do you have a favorite TV show that features real estate scenes that you want me to react to next? Let me know which show or some clips in the comments below and make sure you hit the like button for more videos like this one. Thanks so much for watching.